Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another episode of the Drafted Glory series. Hope you guys have been enjoying this one so far. This one's been doing not too bad on my channel. So if you guys are if you guys are loving this series, make sure you show some love and subscribe down below. But before we get into the draft and all the packs you can see on the screen, I do want to tell you guys to come follow me over on Twitch. The team we've been building, we've been playing weekend league, grinding rivals, objective players, all that type of stuff. I play over on Twitch. So make sure you go follow me over there. There is a link down below. And make sure you follow me so you can join in there. But we're going to start off this episode with some exciting packs we got two gold packs two rare gold packs two rare plays pack and a two rare gold pack these are all from uh, my div rivals rewards i'm in div four and i got ranked two this week um so decent rewards these are on the untradeable ones so i'll we'll open this two rare gold players pack first see if we can get anything decent in these can you imagine if we start this episode with a crazy pull doesn't look like it's anyone but i may be i may prove wrong it's a board though uruguay center back is that Godin from a two rare players pack? That is not too bad. He is some SBC niceties right there. And Hamzik as well. 85 rate. That's not too shabby. All right. So next up, we have the gold pack. After that, decently packed Godin. I'll take that from a two rare gold players pack that came from an objective. But this time around, from the gold pack, this is an untradeable pack. What do we can get here? Flair was all right. Nah, nothing, nothing, nothing. We get Bernard, who we already have. And that was a bit of a stinker. All right, so next up is the second gold pack. Come on, anything in here. Bernard was terrible in the first one. This didn't look any better. <laughs> it didn't look any better. Jose Font. All right, so now we get into the few more juicy players, the rare gold pack. What are we going to get in here? I think this is all... Is this all players? No, it's not all players. Or is that a Champions League card, I think? No, it's a Libertadores card, which means there might be something better behind it. But... It's hard to say. Well, we get David Neres, which isn't too bad, you know. Isn't too bad. We're not really building an, uh, an Eredivisie side, but we get Diallo as well from PSG. All right, so the second rare gold pack. That first one was all right, all right. Could have been a little better, but it wasn't too bad. This time around, what do we get? Flair was about the same. We get a board. Is that, uh, is that Senegal? Yeah, this is Gay, right? Idrissa Gay, not... Not too bad, you know. 84 rated. He's not too bad. And we get Saul. Again, and two 84 rated players. Again, both a bit eh. And we get Tamori as well. Who I actually think we put in an SBC. So good to get him in. And uh, we get an engine card. So again, another another average decently packed. All right, these are the packs we're talking about. 12 items, all rare. I'm hoping for something decent in this one. Let's see who we get. Come on. First rare players pack. Something decent. Come on. Flair was decent. What do we get? It's a board. German. Cam. Bayern Munich. Who's that? Goretzka or Muller? Hey, 86 Muller. Hey, that's not too shabby. He's not a player we can really use, but again, some more SBC players. We get Regulon as well. Payet. We get normal Dumfries and a bunch of other randoms, but Thomas Muller. Not too bad. Regulon as well. Not too shabby at all. All right, and so the final rare players pack from our rivals rewards. Who are we going to get? This should be exciting. Decent player in the last pack. Looks like it was a blue flare. Probably going to... Oh, no, is this a freeze? Is this a freeze? Hey, we packed a foot freeze. I don't know who it is. Rodriguez. Average foot freeze, but we pack a foot freeze. CDM Rodriguez. Hey, that's not too bad. Probably the worst foot freeze we get but we get Alfonso Davies in this pack come on big left back Jerome Boateng as well a uh, couple of other players but Rodriguez hey we get our first foot freeze player that we packed he doesn't I don't really know how he's going to fit into any team I have I don't really have a Italian team or a Swiss team um, but hey you know what we'll take it a foot freeze player we get Alfonso Davies as well that is not too shabby <laughs> Well, so now we got that fun out of the way with those packs. That was definitely, that went a lot better than I thought it was going to go. The rivals was worth grinding this week, but it's time to go into another draft. Let's jump into it with points. What formation are we going to go in with? We've got a 4-3-2-1, not too bad. 4-1-2-1, 4-1-2-1-2, which I like, just because I like the two strikers. Uh, so we'll go with this one. I feel most confident with this formation. The foot freeze cards are out as well, so hopefully we can pick up one of those. Oh, to start out, you know what? I'm going to take Varane just because he is so OP in this game. 
and he could be a huge center back for us up front we get ooh, i guess we'll take we'll take timo Werner. um decent pull oh we get 95 messi Jeez. all right all right then there is the uh road was that best of the group stage oh we get the nanny we get the foot freeze nanny it doesn't really link it wouldn't link at all we could take Havertz. I think we might have to take Havertz just because of the link to, v to Werner. All right, let's see. Who do we get as our centre mid? Anyone? Ugh, no one decent. We'll take Van der Beek. All right. And then the other centre mid. Come on. Who are we going to get? Someone decent. Oh, Seydorf. Thank you very much. Let's uh, switch sides. Should help with the chem. There we go. And the CDM. Big position here. Big position. Need someone huge. That is not someone huge we need, but we will take Wilfred and Didi. Doesn't link to Varane, but we've got a little bit of a Premier League thing going on here. Let's go left back. Come on, who are we going to get? Oh, ah, shocking pick, shocking pick. We'll need a better We'll need a better left back in the reserves and a centre back again. What's going on? We'll take this guy just because he links to, uh, to Varane and the right back. Come on, someone decent. A Trent or someone will be perfect. Oh, okay. Yeah, we'll take Carver Howell. Just with the rating and the link into Varane. But he doesn't really fit into the team. And in goal, we probably could do with Courtois. No, we don't get Courtois. You know, we'll just take Ruffier for the rating. And we know what? We'll fill it. We'll fill the reserves first. We'll mix it up a bit. We'll fill the reserves. See what we get in here. We get Podence. Ooh, okay, okay. I think we might have to take Mendy. Just because he's French. And also he's from the Premier League as well. Canate wouldn't be bad. But uh, you know what? We'll take, we'll take Mendy. And we'll stick him in down there. We're already at 97 chem with Messi in the team as well. So we don't have to improve too much. We get an 81 Cater. Who could maybe be a bit of an improvement. But do we go for the rain? You know we go for the rain. We'll take Bernardo Silva. He's not going to play. But we'll take Bernardo Silva. And then who else? We get Weghorst. Yeah, and none of these guys are going to play. So we'll just take the highest rated. And then who do we get here? Right. We get Sergio Ramos. Who I guess kind of could work if we take out that 75 rate center back we get Semedo as well who we could play you know what let's take Sergio Ramos and let's stick him in here and let's put them let's switch him around because he links with Carver how nicely Ooh, okay okay I think we probably take Sam Maxima we'll take Sam Maxima right, what do we need I guess another center mid um and a couple of better strikers I think is probably what we need to make this draft really, really good. And we get Courtois. That's huge. With the Real Madrid link as well. That is huge. Get him in the team, Courtois. 100 chem, 87 rated. Not too bad. 187 rated. Probably just looking to take the highest rated players. We take Sergio Roberto. We've already got 100 chem. So it doesn't really help. But um, we'll see how he... Maybe if he fits in the team. And we get Guerrero. Again, doesn't fit into the team. But we'll just take him for the rating. Who else do we next have? Oh, okay. A bit of a stinky pick. So we'll... We'll, you know, we'll take the highest rate. We'll take Grifo. Come on. Three players. Need a good central midfielder. And another striker would be decent. We get Casemiro. Is he going to play? Probably not. Gundogan. Is he going to play? Probably not. Let's take Leroy. Uh, it might be a good option off the bench as a super sub. And we get... Oh! Cristiano. Thank you. He's just not really going to fit into the team at all, is he? Oh, he fits in ahead of of Messi. Who do we play? Do we play Ronaldo or do we play Messi? And we get no one in the last pack and we get dumb freeze. Uh, let's sort out the bench a bit. See whether we can maybe up the rating. You know what? I feel like I'm a Ronaldo guy, man. I'm a Ronaldo guy. I feel like we've got to play Ronaldo. Let's get ourselves a manager. We've got 100 chem. That was the most important thing. Who do we bring on? We'll bring on Diego Martinez. Maybe I can bring in Messi instead of Havertz, maybe, to mix things up. But uh, that is not a bad draft. You know, 187. No foot freeze cards, though, which is slightly frustrating given that they're in, they're in packs at the moment. But let's play the first game. It's been a little bit of a while since I played draft. The last couple of episodes have been recorded quite a while ago. So I may be pretty poor. So let's hope, hoping, hoping that's not the case. And let's see who we get in the first game. Guys got Neymar, Suarez, Messi... Go on, all right, team, but nothing too crazy. Let's jump into it and see how it goes. Well, that was a sweaty half if I've ever seen one. 
I forget. I completely forgot. As I was saying earlier, I completely forgot how sweaty draft is. It's just, it's a bit, it's a bit mad, you know. Everyone, everyone's very try hard with all of these sick players. It's, uh, it's a bit of a, it's a bit of a pit. This one. How many times do we want to lose the ball and it fall back to him? Oh my God! How lucky was that? Oh man, he got the freeze money. I want that card. Come on, Ronaldo. Come on, Ronaldo. It's the first time we properly got through. It took us took us to go behind to get the good chance. Great finish. Oh, wow. Fair plays. That was a good goal. Ah, we kept him out. No, no, we gave the ball away. Ah. Oh. Well, we're going to have to go attack him. The only way to. His formation's too narrow. I completely forgot to do. Uh, put custom tactics on. Come on. Oh, no, he's missed. Oh. I literally said, come on, we got back into it with a little bit of time to go. And he missed. No, to be fair, I expected this first game, first draft back, we were going to be rusty. There we go, the full time whistle, and we were very much rusty in that first draft. Jeez. I forget. I really do forget. Just like everyone plays ridiculous. Everyone plays ridiculous in draft with all these cracked players. You know what? We'll go into another one because honestly, I needed to get that rust off. I needed to get that rust off. We'll open those packs at the end. All right. Come on. Second draft. We've got the rust out of the system now. Let's see what we get. We got 4 one 2 one 2 wide. 4 one 2 one 2 which is very similar to what we had Four, five, one, four. You know, we're going to go for this one. And um, we'll make sure we do custom tactics this time. Because last time, the team were a bit all over the place. Who do we get off to start? Oh, a pretty average pick. So we'll take Hazard. Let's start with the strikers. As we do, come on. Someone big. Jamie Vardy. Now, do we take this Jamie Vardy, who I know is cracked? But do we take this Messi, who we didn't use last time? But it could be decent. Or oh, this Timo Werner, the informed one. Yeah, well, we'll take the Messi. You think Messi? I right, oh, we'll take Messi. We'll take Messi. We'll take Messi. To partner up front, we get absolutely no one. So we'll take Gignac. We, I think I might play Messi this time. He didn't. Uh... Oh, that Bruno. I want to use this Bruno card, so I'm going to take it. We've got no Ken, but I don't mind. That Bruno card is awesome. I really want it. Uh, we'll take. Uh, we'll just take Kovacic. Come on, who else do we get? Oh, okay, no one good. We'll just take Vidal. I don't link with anyone. We're struggling with Kem here, but we've got a couple decent players. Are we getting Didi again? I guess we have to take him. Just because he's the best one there. We got him last game. We'll have him again this time, looks like. We'll put Tierney in. Come on, who we got at centre back? Oh, I know one decent. We'll take Tap Sober. Struggling on Kem this time. We're not doing too well. I think we'll take... Guess we'll take John Stone. No, do we take one of these guys? Let's take Philippe. Yeah, we are struggling for Kem. We are struggling for Kem. We'll take Nelson Semedo. Yeah, we are struggling for Kem. Reserves and subs are going to have to pull out of the bag. We'll just take this, Donny. All right, come on. Something big. We're going to need some big goalkeepers here. Do we, We'll just take him. Take Pacheco. Oh, we get Jimenez, which we might have to play just for the link into uh, the other centre-back we have. Oh, this one's crumbling, though. This one's crumbling. Oh, we, get a, we get a freeze Torreira. We'll stick him in. 
Got a little Atletico Madrid defense going on. Uh, we, you know, we'll take Hakimi. Maybe a useful super sub to bring on. Oh, why are we getting stinky picks? Come on. We need some big players to really... Oh, I, I really want Neymar, but I need Aguero. Aguero would link to uh, Messi as well. He's got to be up there. We need to get rid of Vidal. Vidal needs to leave the team. Ah, Pogba. Perfect. Get in the team, Pogba. There we go. Okay, that doesn't really do anything. Oh, struggling with Kem. Oh, Zahar. If we bring him in, we can maybe sub Messi on. For Aguero. Who else do we get? Oh, we get Jesus, but... We'll take Zakaria. I don't think he'll improve the team. Come on. Couple of final big pulls. Ooh, we get Fabinho, which... It's probably about the same as Ndidi, but helps get that link into one of the centre-backs. Or we take Sadio. He doesn't really work in the team. You know what? We'll take Fabinho. He doesn't improve our chem. How does he not improve our chem? All right. And our final pick. This has been a bit of a shocker. We'll take Pedence. Okay. Well, this this uh, was a bit of a shocker, this. All right. Fabio Carrillo, you're in. This one, not so good. We got a 187 last time, but we were rubbish. This time around, we get a 180. Not so good, but... I feel like we've got some better players. It's just the chem that's really ruining us. So let's, let me do the custom tactics and let's jump into the first game and see how it goes. Come on, Zaha. No, Zaha. Zaha, you got to be finishing that. All right, let's make the sub. Let's get Messi on. No. Finish. Come on. Big goal. Who is that? Is that Bruno? Is that Messi? With a headed goal. <laughs> what were the odds on that? On a headed goal from Messi. Finish. No, how have you not finished that? Who was that? No. No. Fabinho went wandering in the midfield for the ball. From the goal kick, from the keeper's kick. Come on, Zaha. Come on, Zaha. Big goal. Just before half time as well. Finally. Finally. Oh my god. This guy can't defend. He's decent. The Salah's a problem, but he can't defend. Oh my days. 45th minute. I hate 45th minute. Come on. Finish. Oh, what a goal. Is that Bruno? That is, I think that is Bruno. What a goal. Look at this. What a goal. Curled from outside the box. Fabinho! Yes! Come on! 4-2! Oh man, that Bruno goal got me out of trouble so much. Come on, look at that. Big ass celebration. Wolves are hold a lucky goal. 4-2 it is. Oh. oh my god. Oh man, draft is so sweaty. You know what? Why not again? Oh, he's done it again. Bruno, hey, the new cheat code. Shoot with Bruno from outside the box. Hey, his long shots are mad. There we go. Don't know what's happened to the score there, but we win. Come on. Big goal, big game. It's only first round. It's only first round. <laughs> All right, so after that sweat fest, we got a team with Mbappe and Rashford up front. Oh, well, this should be some more sweaty goodness. This guy is reading everything I'm doing. Oh, no. 
What a save, keeper! What a save. Yeah, this guy's good, man. This guy is very, very good. Why not? Oh, it was worth a strike. All right, let's take him off. Let's take him off. Aguero's had enough time. Let's get the Messi on. He's had enough time. He had his strike on goal as well. This guy is the kind of guy to bring his goalkeeper out, so we'll try this corner. No. Literally, that's how easy it is for his... Oh, man. That was poor defending from me, though. Should have just taken him out when I had a sense of what he was trying to do. Come on, Zaha. Come on, Zaha. Big goal. Big, big goal. Come on. We know we can score against opponents like this. Wolf Zaha. All we need is one chance with the pace in behind. It's just can we stop Mbappe and Rashford? Ah, he read it. He read it. He read me like an absolute Harry Potter book. Come on, keeper. No. Oh, my keeper. Didn't have the pace to get there ahead of Rashford. God, the pace of those strikers is too much, man. Mane, Rashford and Mbappe. Too quick. Keeper, the keeper could have probably started a little bit higher. That all came pretty much from my chance at the other end. No. No, it's all gone to pot. It's all gone to pot. We concede one and then two come along. How's, how has he beaten Semedo to that ball? Oh, man. I'm telling Mbappe. Back in the day, you'd have to press some crazy PlayStation combination for uh, for Mbappe to do what Mbappe does in this game. He's such a cheat code. He's too quick. He's too quick. He's too good, Mbappe. He's too damn good. Wow, well, we get one back. We get one back. Oh, why Mbappe do you have to do this to me? I just, I need Mbappe. Oh, there it is. Oh man, Mbappe. Mbappe absolutely ruined us there in the second half. Jesus, if you don't have him on your team, man. He's worth all the millions of coin. Is it worth a million coins? I think he is Mbappe. Jesus, he has an inform card as well. God help me if he gets a team of the year or something. It's KO for everyone. What do we get for one win? A premium gold pack. Let's get these silver packs, player packs out of the way. End up this episode. Come on, let's skip these. Not going to be anything useful in these. There we go. Phil Bardsley. What a waste. All right, second premium silver players pack. Can you pick it? Can you pack? I think you can pack inform silvers out of this, but I don't think we will be packing any. Oh yeah, a bunch of randoms. All right, two, three gold packs and then a premium gold pack to end off this episode. The gold packs at the beginning of the episode and the rewards weren't very good. And I can't imagine these are going to be very good either. Now, Fernando, get out of here. Absolute trash. Let's get them out. Let's get them out of here. Come on, another gold pack. Can you imagine if these pulled in clutch with something big? Ah, uh, no. Flair was useless. Otamendi. Jesus, he's a non-rare now. Flipping hell. Alright, come on. Two more packs. And then this episode is done. What are we going to get in this pack? Again, Flair, Useless, Sergio Oliveira. What are these players? SBC players. SBC players. They're not going to go for anything. Alright, and then the premium gold pack. Three rares. Come on. Something decent at least from the rewards. It's been horrendous. Come on. No, it's not even a board. It's Berg Wies. 
Oh, man. Uh, we even already have him. We get Diallo. Barcelona badge. Not much else. Bergwies. Does he go for anything? You know what he doesn't, but you know what? Let's just list him. And there he goes. That is the end of this episode, guys. Hope you enjoyed this one. I was definitely a little bit rusty. Got to get on more of that draft grind. But make sure you guys subscribe below if you're not already. And I'll catch you guys on the next one.